Okay, in this problem we have to evaluate the cinch of 5 and the tanch of negative 2. And we're going to do it two ways. We'll do it by hand and I'll show you how to do it in the calculator. So first let's do this one here, cinch 5. So the cinch of x is equal to e to the x minus e to the negative x over 2. So if you want to work this out, basically you just put a 5 where the x is. This will be e to the 5 minus e to the negative 5 over 2. So let's go ahead and, and type this into the calculator here. So e is a blue key, so it's here where it says ln. So I have to hit second first. So second ln, so it's 5. Actually, uh, I'm going to want parentheses here, so I'm going to type in parentheses, second ln, and then 5, and then the arrow key, and then minus, make sure to hit the minus key, not the negative sign. This is the minus key here underneath the x, and then second ln, then this is the negative key right down here, and then I'll hit my arrow key, and then parentheses, and then divided by 2. So that's it, 74.203. Now there's another way to do this, it's even easier. So down here there's a blue key called catalog. So you want to access that. So you want to hit second first, and then hit zero. And then you're looking for cinch, so hit the letter S. So the letters are in green. So it's right here where LN is, there's a green S. Let's try it. And then I don't see it, so I'm just gonna like Hope it's there by clicking down. It should be there. Getting there, getting there, almost there. There it is, cinch. So enter, and then five parentheses, enter, and there it is. So 74.203. So two ways to do it. You can do it with the formula, or you can just use your calculator. So 74.203. Now, in order to do this one, uh, you should know that tench is equal to cinch over cosinch. So it's cinch of negative 2 over cosinch of negative 2. Now cosinch is very similar to cinch except it has a plus sign. So it'll be e to the x plus e to the negative x over 2. So what happens is when you divide these, the 2's are going to cancel. So this is actually equal to, so this one will be up top, it'll be e to the x well, I guess not e to the x, it would be e to the negative 2 minus e to the negative negative 2. Yuck. So 2. And this one would be e to the negative 2 plus e to the negative negative 2, so 2. So you could type this in your calculator and, and get the answer. So again, for tench, write the generic formula for you, it would be e to the x minus e to the negative x over e to the x plus e to the negative x. It's a little bit confusing here because uh, there's a minus here. That's because the 2 is negative. It makes it even worse. So let's go ahead and, and, and type it in. Um, actually, let's take the shortcut. Let's just use the tanch key. So uh, the tanch key is under catalog. So we'll go back to catalog. So second, 0. And then the letter t. So the letter t is right here, where the 4 is. And there it is, tanch go to it and then negative 2 and so there it is 0.964 so this is equal to uh, negative 0.964 we could check we could check that our formula is correct let's go ahead and do it it would be e to the negative 2 so parentheses e to the negative 2 then arrow key minus e to the 2, arrow key, parentheses, divided by parentheses, e, it's a lot of work to type this in, negative 2. It's easier just to use the commands in um, catalog. It's totally a better way to do it. And then this is e to the 2. Moment of truth. This should be the same thing. Let's see. There it is. So we know we did it right. So two ways to do it. You can just use the formulas for cinch and tench or you can just actually access these functions using the catalog feature uh, in your calculator. So it's worth knowing these though. It's worth like memorizing um, this one.
and this one just like for life, just for math. And it's worth knowing that tench is cinch over cosinus. Like this is stuff that you know you want to know uh, for other for other math classes. That's it.